And we did end up seeing as much as two to five inches of rain, which is what we were forecasting, about five inches in Dunn, a little under four inches in Fort Liberty, uh, over three and a half in Cary, about three in Rayford, about three in Clayton, and a little over an inch there in Wake Forest. Of course, it was much heavier down along the coast, especially for Carolina Beach, where there was just this one rain band that just stalled over Carolina Beach, bringing more than 18 inches of rain. Obviously, that's not something that we see very often. Meteorologist Chris Mac uh, Michaels is here to talk a little bit more about just how rare that is. And you heard the National Weather Service in Wilmington saying that this was a 1,000 year flood. And so we're going to talk about what that means versus what that isn't. So that means that there's a one in 1,000 or a 0.1% chance of seeing that much rain on a given day in a given year. Here's what this is not. This is not something that says this much rain will never happen again for another thousand years. OK, it's really just a statistical thing to show just how rare that kind of rain is. Rain here has been quite heavy at times this year. In fact, in Raleigh, we've seen one inch of rain 16 days out of the year. That's tied for second most on record. And you're starting to see how that average is climbing, where we're starting to see more of these wet days over the past five to 10 years, as opposed to the past 50 to 75 years. Now, if you were to look at this through a large scale kind of lens in a warming climate or warming atmosphere for every one degree that the temperature rises, that's 4% more water vapor, which in theory would say that heavy rain events would become more frequent. Elizabeth, let's just hope that we don't see anything quite like what we saw at Carolina Beach anytime soon again. That was so unusual. You know, but if you remember last Friday, we had a little boundary that set up here in Wake County, and we ended up seeing a lot of heavy rain there. So uh, yeah, there's certainly something to uh, our warming climate.